everyone. If you're wondering how can you use natural remedies to attract money or bring money into your house, today I'm going to show you another one of my money rituals. And this one is by using coins and rice. Listen, this is no secret. This is something that's been around for decades, for centuries maybe, and a lot of people just don't know about it. So today we're going to find out what happens when you mix rice and coins. And listen, watch this video all the way to the end because you guys know I always throw in extra tips to help supercharge your manifestations. But before we get started, if you're new to my world of metaphysics, this is a law of attraction metaphysical channel that brings you life-changing information. So join the family. Don't forget to support by liking, subscribing, and tapping the bell. Now, let's get started. I'm back. Now, what is it that I have to tell you about the simple technique using rice and coins? Listen, you can use any denomination of coins. You can use pennies, nickels, dimes, quarters, half a dollars, if they're still around. But you can use anything and mix it with rice. But listen, it's just not that simple. So watch this, and I'm going to show you quickly how to do it. Okay, everyone. Right now, I have a couple of my bowls that I have around my house. You can find these bowls anywhere in the stores. Be creative. Different stores have different things. Um, again, these are small bowls and you're going to have some rice. Okay. I'm not being specific about rice. You use whatever rice that it is that you like. And then you need some coins. So here I have some quarters. I have some dimes. I have some pennies, nickels. So, but again, you don't need that many, but you need coins and rice. Now what you're going to do, you're just going to Basically, place a coin at the bottom of whatever container you're using, okay? And then you're going to sprinkle a little bit of rice on top. And then you're going to place a couple of more coins. And then you're going to place a little more rice on the top. And a couple more coins. And some more rice on the top. And if you want to, you can top it off with a couple of coins. Now, this is the way it should look. You see, rice is a big attractor. It attracts abundance in many ways. And when you mix rice and coins, it ba basically brings in abundance. Now, where would I put this? You want to make it very indiscreet and you want to place it in a small dish. So you can place this in something small like this or smaller. You can place it in your offering hands like I usually do. Or you can go and buy a ceramic um, decoration dish and place it in something like this. Okay? But the thing is, place it in something small. And now I'm going to tell you where you're going to place this. Now, for me, the best place to place rice and coins is by your front entrance, okay, of your house. <laughs> Bring it in that good luck, okay, that feng shui. I would place it behind my front door so when people walk in, they don't see it. They might see it walking out, but it would be behind the front door. Or you can place it as a decoration and have it when you first walk in, in something that people just think is just a decoration. Another place you can place the rice and the coins, you can place it in the corner of your home, okay? Another place is maybe in your office as a decoration to bring in that abundance at your job. Now, what kind of abundance do rice and coins bring in? It can open the doors to uh, money. It can open the doors to opportunities like a new job or a successful business or new customers. It can do many of these things, and that is the purpose of it, okay? So I'm telling you to try this. Now, let me throw in a little extra tip for you guys because you guys know I like to throw in extra tips. For me, once I do this, I might add a money-attracting crystal. That could be a citrine, okay, for attracting money. It could be a pyrite. It can be a red jasper. Um, you can put in here whatever crystal you feel that resonates with you that attracts abundance. 
I might would put that on the top like that, or I might place it underneath the rice, okay? These are little things that you can do to bring in abundance. And listen, you guys, this absolutely works. You just put it there and leave it. Now, a lot of you guys are probably saying, how long do I keep this there? Listen, put it there and leave it. And if you wanna make it nicer, hey, look, change it sometimes and make it look nicer. But the thing is with feng shui, and when you're talking about manifesting rituals, you wanna bring that money in constantly and keep it flowing. So there is no need to replace it. Now listen, this was very quick and very simple and it brings in money and I'm telling you it works. So listen, this is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics. Don't forget this is the Law of Attraction metaphysical channel that brings you life-changing information. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and tap that bell to get notification of my videos. Don't forget to watch the next video and listen, you can follow me at myworldofmetaphysics.com where you can get one-on-one -on -one coaching from me. You can also go to store.myworldofmetaphysics.com where you can buy crystals and candles and sage. Most of the things you see here on my videos. Again, this is Yvette and namaste.